I'm Loïc, your favorite wine taster, and now we will taste Le Bordeaux de Mocaillou from Chateau Mocaillou. It's a Bordeaux wine 2012. Uh, the Bordeaux is a big region, as you may know, in France, and from which the majority of wines are red. And from those reds, mostly they are dry, medium to full bodied reds. So, this is what established their reputation. Uh, second fact about the wine, the red wines, um, the finest and most expensive as well are located on the left banks and on the right banks, the saint emilion area which brings together with Pomerol the very famous chateaux from Bordeaux. So Bordeaux is famous mostly for the red wines but it also produces white wine, white wine which mostly are dry or liquorous, as you may know, especially coming from Sauternes area, which produce very nice and kind of expensive wines as well. Here we have Le Bordeaux de Mocaillou, which is the second wine from the Chateau de Mocaillou, it's a 2012. The chateau is uh, located on the left bank of the uh, Bordeaux area, between Margot and Saint Julien area, so the, 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 the small area in between, they are there. They produce uh, very nice wines all together, very typical, using the very typical blend from Bordeaux, which is Cabernet Sauvignon, Merlot, Cabernet Franc. So here we have a wine which uses 45% Cabernet Sauvignon. 43% Merlot and the tiny rest, 12% is Cabernet Franc. So, Cabernet Sauvignon brings the flavors, brings some kind of strength and balance. Merlot brings lots of fruits and Cabernet Franc, this little 12%, will bring this uh, bit more of stronger strongness in the wine. Here we have a wine with a deep color. Fruity, spicy nose, dark berries, so all in general, the spice and the berries to remember. This is a wine which was aged in barrel 18 months, so therefore it brings those strong aromas in the nose. In the mouth it's quite fruity, quite light. Easy, quite easy actually. The, the same aromas of blackberries, blackcurrants, uh, all coming from, from the Cabernet and from the Merlot, but also this long finish helped uh, or sustained with the, by, the, by the aging in barrel. All this makes, makes it a wine which is actually very affordable, both in price being the, the second wine of the, of the Chateau, and, but also in terms of, of tastings. So lately it's a wine which you drink together with, with, with meat, uh, like very often for the, for the red wines from Bordeaux. Uh, here especially the duck, uh, if you are out there in the region, you go a bit further to the, the re region Gascogne and you get the duck there. Uh, or in general grilled meat or cheese, all cheeses, so something that will sustain the, 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 the wine, the, the flavors of the wine. So as a fat seat, as a resume, a very nice wine which I recommend you to, to, to taste, to try. Very affordable in terms of taste, uh, very easy to drink, very complete, uh, interesting, very interesting and made from a producer which has a um, tradition of doing excellent wine, of doing very high level wine. So this high level you find here in this wine and for more information I recommend you to go further on the uh, links shown uh, under this video and to subscribe to our wine channel and not to forget the Facebook page which you can like 
I hope you enjoy watching this video. I hope to see you again for the next video. And till then, have a good one.